Hey guys, just wanted to show you a couple things on the screen share button. So I'm sure you've probably explored with it. So you can know uh, you can connect a phone, or um, if you have an Apple device, you can go through AirPlay, and you can show different browsers that are up or videos that are up on your computer. So for instance, uh, I have a Google Chrome browser open, and so I can share what's on that browser. So every student sees my screen just the way it is, and then they have the whole class on the side just like I do and we can move this around however is necessary so if I wanted to talk about uh, Vincent van Gogh's uh, painting then I could do that it's a Google Arts and Culture if you haven't explored that it's really cool and then you can zoom in and just see the paint strokes and how thick everything is um, and then actually I'd have to move this over here so I could oh, I can go in further I think oh look at that that's amazing <laughs> So anyway, uh, you can show them exactly what you've found on the internet. You could also make that smaller if you want. But it's probably good to uh, keep an eye on everybody. And then I could switch over to like a Google Slides presentation that I had, and I could present it, and they would see it up there. So I could show all these different uh, awesome basketball courts that have been made. There's actually one of these in Berkeley, Missouri. I used to teach over there. So, yeah. Um, then you just, up at the top of your screen, there's a, the opportunity to stop a share or just begin a new share, uh, things like that. Uh, you can annotate, which means you could, like, uh, point something out. So I'd be like, oh, I really like this right here. And if you wanted to change the color, go ahead and change the color and be like, look at the way they did these shapes right here. So you can do that right on your screen. And then you can clear everything if you'd like. Clear all drawings. And you can also have other people draw um, with certain things like that. Okay? So uh, that screen sharing is just really good. I like to use it for um, showing different things. Now, uh, it's also might be a good idea to use a lot of those things for the asynchronous learning and stuff like that. Also, if you look down here, uh, you can record. So if you're doing like a demonstration, so if you have your second camera going, you can use uh, your doc cam. So if you go to advanced, you can do like your document camera or you can plug in your phone. Uh, either way, uh, with your second camera and you do like a demonstration, then uh, I, I would record it so that you can post it uh, on Schoology or whatever, and so kids can go back to it during their asynchronous learning time. So you're kind of uh, killing two birds with one stone there in that way. Um, they're able to go back and view the lecture, and then they can ask you about uh, the demonstration and things like that. So anyway, I uh, hope that helps. If you have any questions, uh, feel free to give me an email, all right? Hope you guys are doing well. I'll talk to you later.